so this is my module uh, it, I have it here made two times because I thought I would make it I thought it would be useful to have two of them but I need only I need only one clock so so I haven't done I haven't made anything for the top part but the bottom part should be visible this is a divider binary divider and here is my signal hopefully you can see that it is coming out it is coming out from this module and I have long cable I have long cables and it is going to this divider I use it to make rhythms because my, I I don't have anything else to make them with this module does not work and also hi Sam <laughs> uh, I'm also working on a copy of circadian rhythms from tip top but it looks like this right now so yeah <clears throat> so this is my only option this module <clears throat> and I might use it to make to show some things things and as like an as an exa example for the for the impulses that come f uh, out from my clock source I've hooked up a mutable instruments brights uh, uh, and it is producing the kick sound that you, that you hear so the first version of the code you can all find them on my github the first the first version of my code was simply that you turn the knob to change the BPM and that was all and because I uh, use this divider I usually plug the kick to divided by 4 and some other drums to uh, divided by 2 and because I hate it to like spin it like this to about 480 because I usually use 120 BPM <coughs> so divided by uh, so 480 divided by 4 is 120 uh, so I uh, created a new version, and I want uh, just wanted a version with a uh, that yeah you can see it. Uh, with the decimal point, uh, uh, which symbolizes how much you will add. And if you press that, the press the encoder, <coughs> you will move the you will move the decimal point to a different place. So if I press it once, it goes to two it goes to the second digit <coughs> and if I then turn it up I add by I add 10 tens then if I press it again it goes to 100 I add hundreds if it, if I press it again it goes to thousands and if I press it again it goes back and that was all I wanted it to do but then I but then I started thinking that I could make it <clears throat> in a way that I don't have to uh, set it to 480 at all, at all, but I can set it to multiply the multiply the tempo. And for that, I I needed to make a menu, and also other functions started uh, 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 and other ideas started to come into my ma into my head. So you access the menu by holding the encoder button for about a second. And there are, uh, I think, six or seven thing, uh, seven settings that you can change. Uh, when you open <coughs> the menu, you will be, uh, you will see this uh, disp, D I S P, and that stands for display. And if you click it, you you can uh, you see real and set, also back that goes back to menu, and. This is for the multiplying and dividing. This is for multiplying and dividing the tempo. That if you set it to multiply by four, and you have this set to real, the display will show 480. Even though you set <coughs> 120 before you set the multiplying, and if you set it to set, <coughs> uh, then it will show 120. But the tempo that goes out of the module is 480 BPM. Next thing in the menu is ULT, 
that's because the display can't show M so this stands for, for multiply and here is the multiply menu we can multiply up to I think 16 so 16 times and so I will set it to 4 you can hear it goes faster and I will put the kick to divide it by 4 now there is divide <coughs> that the IV uh, and that that divides the tempo and if you set multiply to 4 and then you try to m divide the multiply uh, number Mm, it, then it will not not let you uh, multiply and divide at the same time and I made it uh, I made it uh, in the way that it that if you change if you set multiply to any number if you just change it here uh, then then it sets divide uh, then it sets multiply to zero uh, to one so if I set it to two then you can hear it that it's not divided by 2 but divided by 8 because I was multiplying by 4 and that multiply that multiplying is set back to 1 and it divided and it divides by 2 so I'm setting, so I'll go back and back to multiply and by 4 okay then there is set and these are presets so that was before I made uh, before I made the multiply and divide menu. So it was uh, it was made so I don't have to uh, set the 480, uh, 480 manually, but I can click it and just select uh, one of these tempos that are that are preset here. Right now you can't set uh, you can't save any changes any changes in the settings. <coughs> because I didn't really learn how to use EEPROM so when you restart the module it will start it will start for, with 100 BPM no dividing no divisions no no multiplying and nothing nothing like that like a basic module so in the set menu uh, there is there are a couple like presets can do and I also notice that you I can't get out of the menu okay whatever uh, then there is uh, this second second letter is, is supposed to be V Ooh, Jesus uh, is supposed to be W so this is swing or SWIN and that stands for swing and you can set the swing rate so if I set it to 10% I don't know if you be able to hear it no you won't because that's going through the divider go back back to multiply set it to 1 plug this back to 1 and then swing and I set it to 20 and it what the heck ok I'm gonna this song this this maybe now you can see it on the scope on the scope but for some reason brights isn't taking it whatever That's strange. Last time when I tested it, it was working fine. But you can see it on the scope that that one of the pulses are, uh, one of the pulses is shorter than the second. So I'm gonna set it, set it back, set it seventy. Go back. Then there is back. If we just go back to back to the BPM setting, and uh, if I go back, I'm go again to menu. Then, uh, if you go up, there is uh, RST, RST, and that stands for reset. If you click it, you are you will see cancel and, and OK, oh, and also, and if you click OK, 
then to reset it to the def default settings <coughs> and I just want to show the multi uh, why I think the multiplying and dividing is useful with this divider so if I go if I set it to 120 go back to menu also I could show the display function with that so if I set the display to real <coughs> and I set to and I, and I set multiply to 4 now replug this then even though you saw even though you saw me setting it to 120 if I go back now it says for, uh, 480 and if I set the display to set then you can see that is 120 even though the tempo is 480 and now the divisions um, not gonna bother, bother you with that because you can figure it out on your own what is useful so yeah that's all